The Midsummer Festival is out, okay? And there's a bunch of quests that we can do. And there's also a dungeon boss, okay? Inside of Slate Pins, there is a dungeon boss called Ahun. So I want to go there on my warrior. I want to blast that boss. I want to get the things because you can get a tabard. You can even get a pet. You can get lots of really cool things and even items, okay? So I want to do these, these pre-quests for that. And I want to go kill that big boss. I want to I wanna slay. I want to defeat. I want to annihilate. I want to dominate that boss, okay? And he's called Ahun. And I'm going to... I'm gonna destroy him. All right, so we're gonna do that. I think that this is up to like the uh, the 6th of August or something like that. So there's a, it's like a limited time and you can get a really good tabard. A really, not good. You get a cool tabard. Look at this guy. He likes spinning, dude. God damn. Look at this, boys. If you're leveling right now, you can go over to these little pole dances here and you can you can get like a stacking buff that gives you 10% more uh, XP and monsters for up to an hour. The longer you spin, the longer you get it. It's actually like, this is like, Midsummer Festival is big fun, man. So let's see here, man. We got a few quests here, I think. Um, I think uh, the, the important one I gotta focus on right now, though, is the unusual activity. It's this one right here, boys. While celebrating it has its place, warrior, some of us must look to graver matters. When the festival began, we received reports on the Soran Strand about a sharp increase in the Twilight Cult activity. The Oregons, Oregons, the origins of this holiday are steeped in the very powers of these madmen revere. This cannot be coincidence. Go to the camp just south of the Black Fathom Depths entrance into ruins and see if the cultists will part with this information. Forcefully, if need be. Use this beacon to summon a guide when you find it. All right. This is the start for the Ahun quest, where you can go inside slate pens and get a big juicer tabard and some gear as well, man. So we're gonna try to go over there, boys, okay? You guys are going to do this quest here there's a secret entrance right down here man where you can run through the woods it's very rare and very secret not a lot of people know about this i'm gonna show you where it is okay guys only want one thing and it's disgusting it's the journey <laughs> all right let's go look at this boys secret little road here look at this it doesn't even show on the map that's how secret it is it's crazy oh wait it does never mind okay so i gotta go to the sorum strand hello it's Mikuzu! I have quest! I'm gonna use my intellect and assume it's over here. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna use my intellect here and assume it's like down somewhere here. Hello! Anyone home? Wait, maybe it's more north act. Oh! I gotta use a totem! Wait, maybe I gotta kill one of these? Haber! Oh, okay, okay, okay. So we kill one, we get paper? What have you uncovered? Uh, this is worrisome, friend. It hints at a much larger plot beyond simple education of the local fire and water elements, and something here bears investigation. <clears throat> According to this, it seems there is another encampment. Let Stop! Okay, I'm gonna steal your dog. According to this, it seems that there is another encampment of the cultists to the northwest of the large gathering on the Sorum Strand, and they're speaking with guests? Much could be learned from listening to these proceedings. Dorf, take this orb. It would allow you to appear as one of the native crawlers on the beach. Spy on the conversation with these guests and the cultists of the Northwestern camp and bring back to me when you are successful. All right, let's do that. Wait, so I'm going to be a crab? Yo, I'm, I'm going to be a crab, man. Gotta head all the way up to the northern quadrant of the Soran Strand. We have an investigation to adhere to. We need to infiltrate the investigation as a crab listen to the hideout hideout and see what they're talking about i'm gonna use my incredible stealth gameplay extreme power gaming genius and assume this is where the location is located we gotta, we, we gotta walk sideways to to rp real crabs walk sideways guys we cannot let our cover be blown man these fish people are up to no good boys okay one back out run back out can i dance i hope i could dance that'd be so cool i tried to dance <laughs> Yo, this right here, boys, is a powerful crab. This crab right here is the number one parsing crab in the world. Nobody dares to face this boy. Yo, yo, that's cool. Okay, that's really cool. Woof, woof. Oh, there he is. Hello? Have we just, have we learned their secrets? 
Oh, fuck! I, I skipped, sorry. Uh, we got a quest. Uh, we gotta go to the capital again. I Sorry, I skipped. I, I, yeah, I uh, yeah, I skipped it. I'm sorry. Yeah, I, I, ha I have like Leatrix Plus, so it skips quest if I don't hold shift. And I, d I forgot to hold shift. Uh, uh, okay, we gotta go to uh, Stormwind again. What troubles you, my child? This is grave news indeed. We must do everything in our power to stop this war from coming to pass. Ahun the Frostlord. I believe you are strong enough for the ultimate task set before us. We cannot allow the plot between the Twilight Cult and the and the Sea Serpents of Neptulon to come to fruition. For the sake of Azeroth and all life upon it, we must act. Our path is clear. You must journey to the slave pens deep within the Coilfrang Reservoir and meet with the shaman there. Go. And quickly. All right, boys. We need to get a group together for, um, for slave pens, man. Okay, so I need to see if we can, we, can, we can get that done, boys. And we can do this up and we can... Uh, we can slay the big Ahun. Okay, there it is. So like, this is where the lady resides. So like, look at all this. Look at that. This is actually really cool. I, I really like that they've like done like an event like this where like the instance changes because of this boss. That's so cool. Okay, so we gotta clear this entire room here. Uh, we gotta clear this so we can we can kill the boss. Yeah, I, I, I do remember doing this in Wrath of the Lich King as well, man. This is so cool. Yeah, I think this is where you summon it. You gotta click this big glacial stone and then you summon the big boy. So let, let's not do that. And let's uh, let's try to uh, stay alive until that, okay? Nobody clicks, nobody click the ice thing. Nobody do that. Okay, let's clear the area first. Full clear. I'ma be real. I have no idea what the strats are. Uh, we can do it though. Yeah, I, I have no freaking idea what the strats are gonna be. One big ad spawns, kill it, then a bunch of small ads, save mana. Okay, okay, okay. So we're gonna we're gonna focus down the ads, and then we're gonna be killing the boss afterwards. And then the boss apparently has a weaken weakening phase where we're gonna be blasting blasting him as well. Okay, sounds good. Yeah, that, that, that sounds good, man. Survive until the boss go to ground and then nuke him. Okay, so he has like a weakened phase. Why we can just blast him then. This shard of ice echoes the deep cracking rumble of invading glaciers. It's turned your thoughts to a lifeless, endless winter. Summon a hoon, the frost lord. Oh shoot. Oh god. Here it is, guys. Oh dude! Yo! It's an ice Ragnaros, man! Okay, focus the ads. Focus the big ads here. I'm, 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 gonna, I'm gonna focus the small ads here because I can cleave, right? And we're gonna need to kill the ad here and then, then focus the boss afterwards, I think. And I think he gets like a weakened face as well. So I'm just gonna blast all these ads here. You can slip on the ice, okay? And you, 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 you might like slap your head into the ice. That hurts a lot, okay? I'm speaking from experience. I'm gonna save my big cooldowns till uh, he gets weakened, I think. I don't know when that happens, but we're gonna do it then. Okay, wait, now! Okay, so we killed the core. Okay, so just pop cooldowns here, I guess. Okay, nice, nice, nice. Wait, I thought it was gonna take more damage than this. Okay, wait. Okay, we might have to do this over, like, multiple attempts then. A uh, hood will soon resurface, okay. Okay, so I, I guess that's the only thing. Okay, so one more phase of this and we can do it. Yeah, because we get execute phase next uh, next time he, he does that. But this is easy clap. Yeah, one more should do. Should be fine. Yeah, you can get some naughty gear from this snacky box. You can also get some RP items and a tabard. So that's what we're doing, man. This is a long fight, man. D dude, honestly, this fight is like as long as Gruul. What the hell? <laughs> yeah, I'm trying to pump, man. Ahun retreats, his defenses diminish. Okay, go, 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 boys. Pump, 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 pump. Okay, we can do it. We can do it. We can do it. Kill it before it resurfaces, guys. Oh. <laughs> Are you kidding me, man? Seven <laughs> percent. All right, we can do it. Kill the boss. Everybody, just focus the boss. Go on the boss, boys. Oh shoot! Wait, just oh, kill the boss. Kill the boss. Oh my god, dude, what is this? Casters, go on the boss. I killed the. I killed the. I killed the ants. Fade and uh. Polyhex, you just focus the boss. I help with the with the ants here. He's almost dead, man. He's so close to dying. Come on. There it is. Yes. We killed it! Yo! You can get this scythe, by the way. It's like a caster weapon. Let's see what we get, boys. Let's see what we get, man. Amulet of bitter... Whoa! I mean, mine is better. Honestly, it's, it's the exact same as mine. Wait, it's the badge necklace! My, dude, honestly, I prefer mine one. Because mine has like... Mine, mine has like... Uh, one less hit, but like, uh, you know, a little bit more HP. I prefer mine, I think. Okay, dude, that's sick. So he, he drops like a batch of justice uh, item, uh, items, basically. Wait, let me pick up the quest here. Shot of a hoon. 
Bring the shot of a hoon to Luma Sky Mother. Do we pick the blue or the red? Guys, I think the red, no? We're a warrior. Like, red is our color. But look how good this fits with the gear. On Badouche, we're gonna pick blue for sure. But red matches so well with the warrior gear. Yeah, and the, the, guys, red is the rage color. It's the color of rage. So it's gonna make me pump more. We're gonna pick the red on the warrior, okay? Tabard of the Summer Flames. Thank you, Gusu. Your name will echo in the chants of the Earthen Ring for days without end. Please honor us by accepting this vestige, a, a symbol of your kingship with form and warm, and I can't read English. Nice. Nice, boys. Make sure you go get this. Uh, if, if you, Even if you don't need the loot or the gear, make sure you go get this Tabard, man. That's such a cool event. I like that.